Hello, I just want to say, before we play this game, I, I don't have the ending to the game in this video. I'm not going to really be editing a lot of this video, just because it's something I'm actually going to explain in the video, but I have what's called phonophobia, and this game really trips it off for me, and I can't really even bear to edit this in any type of way where I have to listen to the audio again because it just really messes with me really bad. Um, and you'll see that probably through the, the, the first, like I play three rounds of this game. The first round probably gets me the most. Um, I want to let you know that though I appear to be in a lot of distress, it may appear to be comical, it may appear to be distressing to you, I don't know, I'm fine, this is after the fact, I'm just recording this because normally I do little jokes here and there, and that's how I transition in my editing, there's none of that in this, I'm literally just going to give you guys the entire raw uh, playthrough, no, no big edits, nothing like that, so it's going to be a long video, there's going to be portions where I'm silent, the game is never really silent, so... Yeah, I just wanted to get that out of the way, I wanted to explain that, and start the video. Hello, and welcome back to Busby Gaming. I'm Tony, and today we're going to play Silent Breath. Now, from what I understand, this is really similar to Don't Scream, where you play as a police officer investigating either the death and or disappearance of five people, and we have to find them as some anomalous things happen and scary things jump up in front of us and if we make a noise we die but let's get into it shall we if you stare at the abyss long enough the abyss stares back hmm. Ooh. it's a pretty game This has kind of been a little bit of a trend too, where they have their faces blurred out. Hmm. I guess we found our first of five. You collect missing poster. He's not dead. Oh, but they are. I had to turn the sensitivity down a little bit because my microphone is right by uh, my computer, which is actually pretty noisy with the fan going, uh, especially for an intensive game like this. Um, so yeah, but it's still fair. And I had it set that if it make a sudden loud noise, it'll go off and I'll die. people before it's too late. Okay. I heard you screaming, lady. I'm coming. Officers on the case. I'll save you. Or become a victim myself. I don't know which one yet. But just like don't scream, I died at least once. See if I can not have that happen again. I got an achievement. I guess that does that count as two? No, it counts as one. Okay. For those of you that don't know, this game is my literal nightmare. I actually have a a fear of loud noises like sirens give me uh, planes flying over it's not like jump scare it's a whole different thing uh, jump scares I mean they get everybody but I was born with a hearing problem and because of that hearing problem any loud noises is like a 
nails on a chalkboard for me. Any kind of droning noise drives me crazy. So, uh, yeah. Uh, this game is going to be torturous. Like, just the sound of crunching through leaves. If it's loud enough, like in real life, stepping on snow, just that, the sound of it. I enjoy it sometimes, but other times, most times, it, uh, bugs the shit out of me. What's going on? Fucking hate the sound. Attention! What happens at sunrise? Attention! Evacuate the forest before sunrise. What happens at sunrise? I'm gonna. Is there a bunch of naked guys standing there watching me? Guess I'll go in the direction of the crow. I, I don't. I don't know where to go. Nightmare, man. I hate this shit so much. What was that? Why are those crows floating in the air? Why are you following me, dude? Why is that big dude in his undies following me? Alright, this this is already a lot more intense than don't scream. Oh My friend. I want to play hide and seek. You Whoa. hide. I seek. Ten, no. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. What what the fuck? No, no. No, no, no. I I don't I don't want no. Oh shit. Um uh whoa. Where, where? Oh Where where am I? Hi like this game dude I don't think I'm gonna be able to win ah <sighs> 
I gotta start all the way over. I gotta start over every time. I'll give it three chances, okay? Before I get done with the abyss staring back at me. I'll do three times. If I can't make it, that that's that dude, I was so fucking spooked out. It, it apparently it doesn't matter if you talk as loud as you want right here because it doesn't show up until the volume uh, thing pops up. But god damn, like that was a lot. Like I have three D audio headphones on. Like I said, I have phonophobia. That was like a sensory fucking overload to me, and that really like I yeah, it was not fucking pleasant. I guess I can only probably do that like one or two more times, dude. I know you probably watch her like, dude, you're just, you're playing it up or, or something for the camera. I'm not. I'm telling you right now, that shit really, like, uh, God damn. Like, I I cannot, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll do two more times. Those stalkers will probably end up getting me again. But, yeah, the, that, that's, that was way too much for, for my... And it's not even the fact that they're creepy looking. It's just there's so much fucking noise and everything going on all around me. And since I I was born with fucked up hearing, anytime I hear a sound that's perceived as a threat, my attention immediately goes to it. And in that game, in this game, it kind of plays that against you. Where it don't, don't scream, it kind of like meant that you're supposed to go toward that noise. And I turn around, and I look, and I'm looking around. It, it, yeah, that was just not fucking fun for me at all. So, uh, I'm, I'm at a loss of words. Like, that legitimately fucked me up. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I got a feeling that, like, this, this is going to be more of a challenge to me than it probably will to, like, 90% of the other the people. Like, I'm not afraid. Like I got, I got a jump scare when I got murdered, but uh, yeah, that that wasn't like the. Oh man, jump scares don't really get me that much. Like I'll jump, like everybody else does, but yeah, when I get sensory overload like that, man, it's like it it almost has like a freezing effect on me. Like in real life, it's called flight or fl where's the body. Oh uh, no, it's gonna be one of those types of games. I don't have a map or anything, do I? Of course not. Okay, so the bodies are gonna change position every time. Fantastic. I was told, like the, well not told, but I heard the scream come from over here. Do that, yeah, that's... Whew. I may even be able to only do it one more time. We'll see. Like if it's either make it or break it, I don't, I don't know. Like I said, I'm gonna try and do three times for you, just because I want you guys to experience this game. And I know you're not quite experiencing it the same way that I am. I know you're probably getting scares, but uh, that, that uh, man, that fucking sound phobia I have is like really fucking with me, and it's not irrational it's like more of a the way my doctor described it, it's like a defense mechanism slash survival mechanism for and the wind going at the same time is really messing with me like don't don't uh, 
Don't scream. Don't scream got me. This is something else different. Oh, God. Oh, hey. I'm sorry for not talking, but I am fucking freaked out. I was waiting for the next big crash or boom or something. This way. It's like all around me. I'm kind of panicking a little bit. I'm sorry. Guys. This is doing a better job of scaring me than Don't Scream ever did. <laughs> I don't know what these stalkers are. Like, there's jump scares that happen in front of the screen, and then there's supposed stalkers. That sneak up behind you and shit. I don't know which one is which. So I don't know if every scare could possibly mean I die if I don't look at it. I don't fucking know what's going on. I don't like spiders. Dude, I am fucking on the edge. I got three more people. I just gotta occasionally look behind me. right now, dude.
Thanks for the tip afterwards. I can't turn my back on her. I don't know what the tip from the first one is. I got one more turn. I only have like what I think two or one or two more left. That's it, it gets to me, dude. Like the longer it goes on, the more intense it is for me. That's great, so. All the bodies that I found last time are not going to be there anymore. I'm trying to fucking help you. So, sends me off in this direction. The, the stalkers are, are really the determining factor in, the, in this game. Because, yeah, Don't Scream was just jump scares. Whereas this you have the jump scares but you have stalkers and each stalker has a different rule and I don't know about you but it looked like there was two different stalkers there uh, the big ass sister that killed me and then there was like a spider dude that was jumping around I think he was the one that killed me the first time so they can fucking gang you and okay so you're back to where you were one of five. They don't carry over. That sucks so fucking much. Especially since the bodies change position, apparently. <sighs> this fucking game, dude. Yeah. I did it, it, it. This is a lot for me. I. Did, it's very rare that it. Like, maybe once or twice it'll happen in a game where the sound triggers my phonophobia. Or fucks with me in some so, some type of way, but this this game is just like hitting all of that. It it just is. It's the the way the way it's designed. It's just uh, really fucking with me, and not in a fun way. Like I said, this is like there's fun scared, and then there's like believing that you're gonna fucking die reaction shit and that's what I'm having so you have okay is it possible to find them all before the sun goes down I think the sun goes down at 7 Or the game just might be giving me a little extra time because I don't believe it went. I think it goes down to seven. Yep. Yeah, 
this. I, I don't... this. I'm really regretting buying this game. I'm sorry, I'm not talking very much because I'm, I'm kind of really not having fun, but I, w I really would like to see the end. I would like to see how it... I'd like to see how it ends, but I have a feeling I probably won't. go again is this man <laughs> how come I can't get out of this gully Okay, that, that's gonna be it for me. Cause I, I the the it kind of just seems real pad the runtimey shit with the the way everything works. You know, there's certain rules where you gotta listen to them. Certain rules where you don't. It's a fun game if you have. Phonophobia, like I do. This, like, I'm not trying to get sympathy, but this game is fucking torture to me, and not, not in any way that's fun. I actually may end up requesting a refund for this game, just because I don't see myself ever being able to fully play it and enjoy it uh, the way most people probably would. So, I'm sorry if this video wasn't entertaining. 
I apologize about that. I should have probably researched this before. I thought it was going to be just like, don't scream. I didn't realize how much this game was going to fuck with me and my hearing problem that I have. So, again, I apologize. You're not going to see the ending from this. I'm probably never going to do another video on this particular game. So, that being said, I promise I will find something more entertaining or something that will not cause me to feel like I'm about to fucking die. It's not a jump scare thing. Sudden loud noises and certain tones just... Like, it sends me into almost like a panic thing. But that's enough about that. Thank you very much for watching. Please, because I suffered so much, like this video if you liked it. If you didn't, hit the dislike button. Please subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Hey, why do I know that my time coming up? Out of my mind, all my time ain't enough. Stayed on my grind many times, I was stuck. Had a wax the rail, rip a tray out like I'm young, cause I am and it seems I got. Little more to give y'all than the people I'm not. Step foot in the game, y'all last change. Uh huh, hate them more cause I'm up and I don't even fly that. But I'm here, I see rappers lying, dark clothes, high fees. I know they hiding, but what you hiding from? You trying to run, you know I'm about to grill your ass. Hey, look, know it's my time, you must sun, I rise, you was on my time when I ride in a beat. Manipulate time like you do with they minds, I'm sick and tired of the lies that you preach.